This is Tri-State Public Safety. Thank you for joining us. And uh, we are taking a look at a brand new exciting product. And this is the new Empower Light Bar from Sound Off Signal up in Michigan. And we're just going to dive right in. So let me start giving you some specs. I'm going to throw a whole lot of information at you because there's a whole lot of stuff going on here. This bar is available in a 44, a 48, or a 53 inch uh, length. What you're looking at today is a 48, and it's actually getting ready to be installed. So we wanted to grab a quick video while we still had, a, had an opportunity. The depth from front to back is basically 10 and a half inches, and your height is one inch. It's one of the thinnest light bars in the industry, period. The light bar is made up housing-wise, uh, top and bottom, of aluminum plates that are painted. And it's kind of a gray uh, paint, if you will. And very well, very well done. The kicker about the bar, and it's available, by the way, in single, dual, or tricolor. So you get your choices there. But one of the biggest features about this bar is the fact that SoundOff has teamed up with the international company called Dow Corning. And if you're not familiar with this already, um, let me tell you a little bit quickly about it. If you are already familiar, you can just fast forward through the video, but Dow Corning is an unbelievable company. But what they have done is they partnered with SoundOff and they've created the lenses for, uh, and the housings actually, for these new Empower lights. Let me zoom in here and uh, I'll see if I can't get a close up of what we're talking about. So what you get is uh, what SoundOff is calling clear duty. And uh, when you hold it, when you feel it, touch it with your fingers, hands, it feels like um, almost like a silicone, kind of like a gel. It's very malleable, very pliable, and you can feel quality. What you feel is you feel a difference that is unlike anything in the industry. And what that means for you is protection. You're protecting your investment. If a rock were to come up and hit this light bar at 100 miles an hour, 200 miles an hour, whatever, whatever the speed is on the highway, it is literally going to bounce off of these lenses. If a rock hits a competitor's lens, it's going to crack it, you're going to get moisture inside, and you've got big problems. So here is another addendum to that. Dow Corning is so proud of what they have made with SoundOff and they're so confident in what they made that they're going to give you a 10-year warranty on these lenses. Yeah, that's unbelievable. That's a first in our industry. Uh, a 10-year warranty against any sun fading, any yellowing, any discoloration. 10 years. What does that mean for a police department or a fire department? That's unbelievable because now you can transfer this light bar from car to car to car. And even though the car doesn't last, the light bar will. You've got a five-year warranty on the LEDs and the motherboard, but you've got a 10-year warranty on the lenses. And again, that is something that has never been done, and that is how confident SoundOff and Dow Corning are in the lenses. Uh, of course, we all know how, how long-lasting the LEDs are, but uh, the lenses typically are not something that you know a lot of attention is paid to. And so these are, um, again, they're, they're, they're almost like a gel type of feel to them. So, and their surface mount modules are the same way. So you can get these in grill lights or, you know, whatever. And unless you take out your pocket knife and, and try to cut them open, there's nothing you can do to hurt them. Uh, temperature doesn't hurt them. Salt, calcium, uh, nothing hurts them. So it's, it's, it's pretty unbelievable. And as you can see there, you can see the painted surface of the, uh, of the upper and lower uh, housings of the light bar. Uh, I did mention that this is available in a single dual or tricolor, which of course it is. You of course have all your normal functions that you're used to, your takedowns and alleys, uh, you know, your traffic advisor, uh, front and rear cutoff, uh, the optical eye, that's the little black dot you see up top there. That's the little optical eye for, um, you can see, maybe even see the little green light in there. That's the photo cell sensor. Some people call it an optical eye, uh, whatever. Uh, that is to sense when the sun goes down at, uh, at night, it will automatically dim your light 
your light bars output by uh, 30%, 25%, something like that. Uh, so you don't have to do anything else. You don't have to flip a switch. You don't have to do anything. This is all in the programming. And by the way, that's also something else I want to talk about. This is a software-based light bar. And what does that mean? This light bar is not your typical light bar that you're going to get a, a cord with a bunch of color-coded wires and then you just take the color-coded wire and, you know, uh, the blue wire does this when you touch it a positive. No, 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 no. This bar is going to have power, ground, and a communication wire. The communication wire is going to get plugged into a breakout box. And then the breakout box, you're going to plug into your laptop or your desktop computer. And you literally are going to have full control over this bar. You're not going to be limited by the programming that an engineer from a manufacturer has restricted you to. You have full user control over this bar, meaning you can set it up however you want. And there are only two companies in the world that are allowing you to do this. That's Whalen and SoundOff. And so if you don't have a software-based light bar right now, you're probably already behind the times. Um, SoundOff and Whalen have been doing it for several years, and um, it's, 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 it's already here. It's been here for a while. So um, the, the control that you have over a software bar is unbelievable. And so let me show you for an example. So you can take a, you can take a alley light, for an example, and you can make it the entire end cap instead of just the alley light. Okay, so for instance, I can uh, literally just take one function, um, which would be your right alley light, and instead of it being the little baby alley light, I can light up the entire corner of the bar. That's what you can do with a software-based bar. You can't do that with a regular, you know, non-software-based bar. Uh, same thing with the left alley light. So I'm actually lighting up the entire corner of the bar right now. Um, something else you can do, uh, an entire, oops, uh, scene light. I may as well go ahead and show you that. Um, you can do a scene light uh, in a non-software based bar. Um, so I don't want to say that you can't, but uh, it is, there are so many more features and it's so much easier to do with a software based bar. Um, than a non-software based bar. So I wasn't going to show you that uh, flood mode yet, but uh, there you go. So of course this has a flood mode. Um, as long as you order dual color and white is one of your colors, you, the flood mode will be uh, an option for you. Uh, you can do cruise mode. And when you've got a software based bar, you can go through instead of just uh, doing you know the four corners which is typically what you'd see in a cruise mode, you can do the entire bar. You know, you can select what modules you want to be in cruise mode. Um, you can select a different flash pattern for each individual light head. I mean, you can get crazy with it if you want to. If you don't want to get crazy, you don't have to. But that's the, you know, that's the latitude that they give you with a software-based bar. And you just, you just have full user control over it. And um, it's not... It's not intimidating. At first, it might be a little intimidating, but once you dive into it and uh, you start playing around with it, you know you're not going to break anything. You're not going to screw it up. You just you just uh, you figure it out. You know, it's kind of like riding a bike for the first time, and um, and it works out. It works out great. So uh, you know, and sound off. Uh, their customer support is unbelievable. You know, they're they'll walk you through any issues you may have as far as you know the the uh, software goes. But uh, so any, anyway, this light bar is uh, packed with options and all your normal stuff is in here so if you're thinking well does it have a rear you know traffic director yes it does um, that is right here so you can see it's doing a uh, traffic pattern right now in the back and I'll show you the back here in just a second so you can see the uh, the rear of the bar doing a traffic pattern you know very simple 
Uh, it flashes two modules at the end. There are multiple different uh, traffic patterns available. Uh, you know, you just, again, in the programming, you just kind of select what you want. So, very easy. So here's a look at the, uh, the end cap of the bar, if you will. Kind of looking straight down the bar. Again, this is all available in single, dual, or tricolor. And that also is going to include your alley light. So let me turn this on real quick and I'll show you. Uh, your alley light will also flash in dual color. So this bar in particular is blue-white. And you'll see that the alley light's firing away, you know, in blue-white. You can obviously turn that off if you don't want that flashing in dual color, but that is, uh, that is available, that is an option. So I just wanted to point that out to you. So I'm going to give you a couple different shots. Obviously, we're back here in the shop. Um, it's a very bright bar. Um, there's no way the camera's probably going to pick up how bright it is. You know, guys just use the camera as a tool. Uh, it's no different than a hammer in your toolbox. You know, it's, it's simply a tool, but it's, it's, um, it's the only thing we've got. So uh, even though we record in high definition, we do the best we can, but uh, this, is, this is all we have to, to kind of give you the best um, experience, if you will, so that you can kind of guide your buying purchase, uh, so to speak. So let me give you some other shots here. So obviously this light bar is ridiculously bright and uh, you know one of the other cool features is you can of course change you know the flash patterns but you can you can change how they flash um, you can take colors out I mean you just get so much flexibility with a software based bar it's almost hard to describe it's kind of hard to talk about um, I'm a very visual person and sometimes it's it's just hard to describe uh, in a in a video uh, or even over the phone to a customer, as opposed to just looking at it, you know, seeing it in person. But um, but I can tell you this bar is uh, very very unique. It's a very cool light bar. Again, it's a, it's kind of a it, it's kind of a a one off uh, sort of a deal because there's nothing else like it, and uh, there's no other competition that that is close. No other competitor that is close in the realm of something that is nearly indestructible. Um, you know, we'll, we'll put their surface mount modules up, against, you know, these Empower modules up against anything because they will literally just take a beating. Um, uh, we've never had one fail. There's, there's almost nothing you can do to kill them. And then you take those modules and you put them in a light bar. Uh, my, my God, I, I, don't know, I don't know what you can do to, to hurt it. Uh, so when you're talking about an investment and you're talking about protecting your investment there's only so many ways you can do it with something that's in the elements uh, as these things are that we put on our cars you know 365 days a year in all kinds of climates hot cold temperature changes you know all kinds of salt and rocks and everything that hits them uh, you need something that's very very well protected and um, Right now on the market, I can't think of anything else that's, that's better protected than this bar. This is a shot of the alley light, um, which is actually the, the entire corner module, not just the, the alley light itself. So I'm going to give you a couple more shots here of the bar. This is, uh, this is what the bar looks like from an overhead view. Let's see if I can get it at the right angle just to show you that they are they are actually kind of squishy. Now 
not as squishy as your normal Empower lenses, but still uh, pretty pliable. So really just kind of a cool uh, cool look, cool design, and very, very well built. Of course, 100% American made, five-year warranty on the light bar, 10-year warranty on these lenses against any sun fading, discoloration, yellowing, cracking, all that kind of stuff. So anyway, this is the new SoundOff Empower light bar. Hope you guys liked the video. If you did, uh, give us a little thumbs up. That lets us know you guys liked it. And uh, otherwise, we'll uh, shoot another video when this bar is on the car and it's all put together and all done. All right, if you guys need anything, give us a call, 513-422-5775, and thanks for watching.